Brandon, you've worked extremely hard to get to this point, to, mm -hmm. to get the comfort of the long-term contract, to have an opportunity to go out and earn a starting job, which you have. Um, talk about that whole process of the way you've grown up in the NFL and, and how football has changed for you. Well, I was just talking about this. Um, man, ever since I got, before, before I even got to the, to the league, it was just like, man, I was always a starter, always, you know, the guy that they was looking up to and stuff like that, or every team I was on. But, you know, I'm just happy I went through that adversity early on in my career, you know, in the NFL because, man, it was just like, you know, do you really love this game? I know you haven't went through that adversity of coming from th third team all the way back up to ones. It's just like, you know, man, it's just, it's just humble. I was already humble, but it just made me really um, work on my craft a little more and know that, you know, my job could be gone just as quick as, you know, it, I got it. Does it kind of illustrate to you that the players who make it in this league are the ones who really pay attention to detail because everybody's got great mm -hmm. talent. Yeah. And then the ones that don't make it, maybe don't put in the time that they need to put in. Yeah, you, you know who I look up uh, to, like, you know, he's been in here, he's been doing it, but still, man, he just be chopping all the time in Sproles. I mean, man, you know, you wouldn't think he'd been in the league 10 years. You would think he's a rookie trying to make the team the way he'd be playing. And, you know, coach always point that type of stuff out. When you got vets out here outworking rookies, then there's a problem there.